Welcome to CAD Engineer. In this video, we are going to design hexanut. To design this hexanut, we need extrude boss, extrude cut, mirror, chamfer, and thread tool. Let's see how to design this part. Let's design this part. We go to sketch tab and select sketch tool, select a top plane. Now I have to define a hexadal shape. For that, we'll take a polygon tool and define the number of sides to be six. So I'm making this hexahedral shape from origin. I define this to be exactly horizontal distance and we'll define the distance of polygon that to be 20 and exit. Now I'm going to extrude this. We'll go to feature, extrude tool. We'll keep it mid plane and specify the total dimension to be nine and do okay. Now we'll select this face, sketch on it. We'll make one circle. That should be tangent to the side edges. So we'll make this edge and this has to be tangent. This and this has to be tangent. So my sketch become perfectly defined. Now exit. I will use extrude cut to remove the material from the side edges. So here I use through all option and use flip side to cut. We will enable the draft option and take the 45 degree angle and do OK. So now the same shape I need to do other side so we can select this and go to mirror tool. We have top plane at middle of the body we can use top plane and do OK. So we are designing M12 nut so we have to take a diameter of 10.38. So I'll select here and make a hole of 10.38 diameter. Go to features and put extrude cut. Remove through all and do OK. Now let me put some chamfer, we'll go to chamfer, I select this edge and the lower edge, we'll specify the distance to be 0.5 and angle is 45 degree and ok. Now I want to create a thread inside it, for that we'll go to hole wizard and under that we'll get one option thread, do ok. Here we have to select that uh, thread from where we are going to apply the thread edge of cylinder body we will select the edge of cylinder body then we can select up to where you want to apply that you can tell the face of the body and here let me take some distance to be little outside so it will be take a start position from outer and here also let me define some position to be outside now we will define what size of hole we are taking that is m12 i'm taking pitch 1.5 and that we are doing metric tab so once we define all the things we'll do okay our nut shape is ready now i want to give some appearance material appearance so now we'll go to edit appearance option here i'm taking steel material and taking polished steel and do okay so this is how we have completed our hexa nut shape thank you for watching this video